EcoBoost is a series of turbocharged, direct injection gasoline engines produced by Ford and originally co developed by German company Fev Engineering and Mazda. The EcoBoost 2L and 2.3L are Ford turbocharged derivatives of the Mazda L engine. EcoBoost engines are designed to deliver power and torque consistent with those of larger displacement cylinder volume, naturally aspirated engines, while achieving about 30% better fuel efficiency and 15% fewer greenhouse emissions, according to Ford. The manufacturer sees the EcoBoost technology as less costly and more versatile than further developing or expanding the use of hybrid and diesel engine technologies. EcoBoost engines are broadly available across Ford's vehicle lineup. Topic. Production, global family EcoBoost gasoline direct injection turbocharged engine technology adds 128 patents and patent applications to Ford's 4,618 active and thousands of pending U.S. patents. Some of the costs of U.S. development and production were assisted by the $5.9 billion ATVM DOE loan. The V6 EcoBoost engines are being assembled at Cleveland Engine Plant No. 1 in Brook Park, Ohio. The 2.0 LI4 EcoBoost engines will be produced at the Ford Valencia plant in Spain in 2009. The 1.6 LI4 EcoBoost engines will be made at the Ford Bridgend engine plant in the United Kingdom. The smaller 1000 cc displacement three-cylinder EcoBoost engine is produced both at Ford Germany in Cologne and at Ford Romania in Craiova. By 2012, the company plans to produce 750,000 EcoBoost units annually in the U.S. and 1.3 million globally in the world market. Ford expected over 90% of its global vehicle lineup includes North America to offer EcoBoost engine technology by 2013. From the engines beginning to November 2012, 500,000 Ford EcoBoost vehicles have been sold. Topic: Marketing PTDI Volvo used the term PTDI petrol turbocharged direct injection for the 1.6 LI4 engine when introducing Volvo S60 concept and for the 2.0 LI4 engine when introducing Volvo XC60. Topic: Engine family list. Topic: Inline three-cylinder. Topic: 1.0 L Fox. Ford produces a 1.0L turbocharged inline three-cylinder engine for the EcoBoost family, developed at Ford's Dunton Technical Centre in the UK. Production started in April 2012. The 1.0 is built initially in two versions, 74 kilowatts, 101 PS, 99 horsepower, and 88 to 92 kilowatts, 120 to 125 PS, 118 to 123 horsepower. The more powerful version delivers a maximum of 170 Nm, 130 pound-feet, from 1,400 to 4,500 revolutions per minute and 200 Nm, 150 pound-feet, on overboost, which makes for a broad torque curve when compared to a naturally aspirated gasoline engine. A 140 PS, 100 kilowatts, 140 horsepower version has also been released in the Fiesta Red Edition and Black Edition, with 210 Nm, 155 pound-feet of torque. 
The engine block is cast iron, which offers, in addition to the required strength, up to 50% faster warm-up than aluminum, at the expense of additional weight, to quell the natural vibrations of a three-cylinder design. Unspecified efforts have been made in the flywheel design to ensure satisfactorily smooth running without the use of energy-sapping balance shafts. The engine is packaged in an engine block with a footprint the size of an A4 sheet of paper. With the introduction of the face-lifted 2013 Ford Fiesta, Ford introduced a naturally aspirated version of 1.0 Fox engine. The two versions produce 65 horsepower and 80 horsepower, and both engines use direct injection and TVCT like the turbocharged versions. Start-stop technology is also available. The engines are produced in Cologne, Germany, and Craiova, Romania, and Chongqing, China. Production is expected to be 700,000 to 1,500,000 units per year. The engine is available in Ford Focus, the Ford Focus-based C-Max and Grand C-Max, Ford Fiesta, the Fiesta-based B-Max, and Transit Courier. This version is also available in the second-generation Ford EcoSport manufactured and sold in Brazil, India, Thailand, and Russia, although in some markets, this vehicle comes with the 2.0L EcoBoost engine. Ford has announced that the 1.0L EcoBoost engine will be available for the American market starting with the all-new 2014 Ford Fiesta sedan and hatchback. It was announced at the 2012 Los Angeles Auto Show, when the 2014 Fiesta was introduced. The 123 HP version is now available in the North American market focus starting with model year 2015. The engine is said to account for just less than 5% of Fiesta and Focus sales in the U.S., according to a 2017 report. In the latest run of events, the 1.0L engine was awarded the International Engine of Year Award 2016, making it the best engine under 1.0L for the fifth time in a row. In 2017, Ford was again awarded International Engine of Year for engines under 1.0L with an almost completely reconfigured version of the EcoBoost 1.0. Although thermodynamically similar to the old EcoBoost 1.0, the new engine features cylinder deactivation under low load conditions. A new dual mass flywheel and a vibration damping clutch disc help neutralize engine oscillations when running on two cylinders. Production started in 2018. Topic. Applications. 100 PS 74 kilowatts 99 horsepower 2012 present Ford Focus 2012 present Ford C Max 2012 present Ford B Max 2013 present Ford Fiesta 2013 present Ford EcoSport 125 PS 92 kilowatts 123 horsepower 2012 present Ford Focus 2012 present Ford C Max 2012 present Ford B Max 2013 present Ford Fiesta 2013 present Ford EcoSport 2013 present Ford Mondeo 2014 present Ford Transit Courier 140 PS 100 kilowatts 140 horsepower 2014 present Ford Fiesta 2014 to 2018 Ford Focus Topic 1.5L Dragon On 24 February 2017, as part of the unveiling of the seventh-generation derived Fiesta Street, Ford announced an all-new aluminum inline three-cylinder 1.5L EcoBoost engine with cylinder deactivation technology. 
The version of this engine announced for the Fiesta Street produces 200 PS, 150 kilowatts, 200 horsepower at 6000 revolutions per minute and delivers 290 Nm, 210 pound feet of torque from 1600 to 4000 revolutions per minute. The engine is based on an expansion of the 1.0 EcoBoost, taking the capacity per cylinder up to 500 cc, which Ford considers is likely to be the maximum for optimum thermal efficiency. The engine is an all-aluminum design with integrated exhaust manifold, low-inertia mixed-flow turbocharger and combines both port fuel injection and direct fuel injection. The engine will be available with cylinder deactivation technology, implemented by stopping fuel delivery and valve operation for one of the engine's cylinders in conditions where full capacity is not needed. Topic. Applications 150 PS, 110 kilowatts, 150 horsepower, 2018 present Ford Focus 182 PS 134 kilowatts 180 horsepower 2018 present Ford Focus 2020 present Ford Escape 200 PS 150 kilowatts 200 horsepower 2018 present Ford Fiesta Street Topic. Inline four cylinder. Four EcoBoost I4 engines are in production. A 1.5L downsized version of the 1.6L, the 1.6L which replaces larger displacement, naturally aspirated I4 engines in Ford vehicles, a 2.0L which replaces small displacement, naturally aspirated V6 engines, and a 2.3L used in high-performance applications. All four engines are turbocharged and direct injected. The production engine family was officially announced at the 2009 Frankfurt Motor Show. Topic 1.5L A 1.5L version of the EcoBoost engine family was first unveiled in the 2014 Ford Fusion as a downsized version of the 1.6L EcoBoost engine. The downsized displacement is a result of Chinese vehicle tax regulations which tax vehicles with engine displacements of 1.5L or less at lower rates. The 1.5L EcoBoost adds new technology compared to the 1.6L on which it is based, including an integrated exhaust manifold and a computer-controlled water pump clutch to decrease warm-up time. In the 2015 Fusion, the engine produces 181 horsepower, 135 kilowatts, 184 PS, and 185 pound-feet. Topic: Applications. 184 PS, 135 kilowatts, 181 horsepower. 2014 Ford Fusion 2015 Ford Focus 181 PS 133 kilowatts 179 horsepower 2017 to 2019 Ford Escape 162 PS 119 kilowatts 160 horsepower 2017 to 2019 Landwind X7160 PS 118 kilowatts 158 horsepower 2015 Ford Mondeo 150 PS 110 kilowatts 148 horsepower 2015 Ford Focus 2015 Ford C Max Topic 1.6L 
A 1.6L version was first unveiled in the 2009 Lincoln C concept. The engine is rated at 178 horsepower, 133 kilowatts, 180 PS, and 180 pound-feet, 244.0 Nm. The European market version of the 1.6L provides 150 horsepower, 112 kilowatts, 152 PS, although a 160 horsepower, 119 kilowatts, 162 PS version is used in the Ford Mondeo. The 1.6L EcoBoost engine is raced in the British Formula Ford Championship. The units have replaced the original NA 1.6L Duratec units, which in turn replaced the 1.8L ZTEC engined cars. The engine has also been used for the past few seasons in the WRC in the Ford Fiesta. The 1.6L EcoBoost engine is also produced at the Ford Bridgend engine plant in Bridgend, Wales. Topic. Safety and recalls In 2013, Ford has recalled certain Ford Escapes equipped with this engine due to the potential for them to catch fire after overheating. In 2017, Ford recalled over 360,000 Ford Escape, Ford Fiesta Street, Ford Fusion, Ford Transit Connect, Ford Focus, and C Max Hybrid with 1.6 EcoBoost engines because of a risk of engine fires caused by a lack of coolant circulation. There were 29 fires in the U.S. and Canada reported to Ford. The recall partly contributed to a charge of US$300 million by Ford. Topic. Specifications Type turbocharged, direct gasoline injected inline four cylinder engine with twin independent variable camshaft timing displacement minus 1596 cc 1. 6 L 97 CU in. Topic. Applications 120 PS, 88 kilowatts, 118 horsepower. 2013. Volvo V40150 PS, 110 kilowatts, 148 horsepower. 2010. Ford C Max. 2010. Ford Focus. 2010. 2018 Volvo S60. 2010. 2018 Volvo V60. 2012. Volvo V40160 PS, 118 kilowatts, 158 horsepower. 2011. Ford Mondeo. 2011. Ford S Max. 2011. Ford Galaxy 180 PS 132 kilowatts 178 horsepower 2010 Ford Focus 2013 2016 Ford Escape 2014 2016 Ford Transit Connect 185 PS 136 kilowatts 182 horsepower 2010. Ford C Max. 2010. 2018 Volvo S60. 2010. 2018 Volvo V60. 2011. Ford Focus. 2011. 2016 Volvo V70. 2011. 2016 Volvo S80. 2012. Volvo V40 2013 Ford Fiesta Street Europe 2013-2014 Ford Fusion 200 PS 147 kilowatts 197 horsepower 2016 
2017 Ford Fiesta ST 200. Topic 2.0L 2010 to 2015. A 2.0L version was first seen in the 2008 Ford Explorer America concept. The engine was rated at 275 horsepower, 205 kilowatts, 279 PS, and 280 pound-feet, 380 Nm. It is the first EcoBoost engine to include twin independent variable cam timing, TVCT, with advertised 10 to 20% better fuel economy while maintaining the performance of 3.0L V6s. This engine is derived from the 2.0L Mazda L engine block used by Ford in the North American Focus MK3, but equipped with unique heads, fuel injection system, and Ford's TVCT. It should not be confused with the Mazda 2.3 DC Turbo, which also features direct injection along with turbocharging, but shares little else aside from the same engine block. The 2.0L EcoBoost engine used in North American vehicles is now produced at the Cleveland Engine Plant in Brook Park, Ohio. Topic. Specifications. Type turbocharged, direct gasoline injected inline four cylinder engine with TVCT displacement minus 1999 cc 2 L 122 CU in. Topic Applications 203 PS, 149 kilowatts, 200 horsepower at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 221 pound-feet, 300 Nm at 1,750 to 4,500 revolutions per minute. 2010 Ford S Max. 2010 Ford Galaxy. 2010 Ford Mondeo. 2010-2011 Volvo S60 2.0T 2010-2011 Volvo V60 2.0T 2010-2011 Volvo V72.0T 243 PS 179 kilowatts 240 horsepower at 5500 revolutions per minute 270 pound feet 366 Nm at 1900 to 3500 revolutions per minute note torque figures are not uniform for all of the following vehicles 2010 Ford Mondeo 2011 to 2015 Ford Explorer 2011 to 2014 Ford Edge 2011 to 2017 Range Rover Evoque 2011 Ford S Max 2012 to 2016 Ford Falcon 2013 to 2015 Ford Escape Ford Kuga 2013 to 2015 Land Rover Freelander 2 2013 to 2016 Ford Fusion 2013 to 2017 Ford Taurus 2013 to 2015 Lincoln MKZ 2015 to 2017 Land Rover Discovery Sport 2015 to 2018 Lincoln MKC 255 PS 188 kilowatts 252 horsepower at 5500 revolutions per minute 270 pound feet 366 Nm at 2000 to 4500 revolutions per minute 2012 Ford Focus Street 290 PS, 213 kilowatts, 286 horsepower at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 310 pound-feet, 420 Nm at 1,900 to 3,500. 2008-2017 Vool 05. 
305 PS, 224 kilowatts, 301 horsepower at 5500 revolutions per minute, 366 Nm at 2500 revolutions per minute. Ford RPE Radical Performance Engines 2011 Radical State Route 3 SL Topic 2.0L Twin Scroll 2015 A redesigned 2.0L EcoBoost four-cylinder was introduced with the second-generation Ford Edge, followed by the 2017 Ford Escape in spring 2016. It features a higher compression ratio than its predecessor, 10.1, 1 versus 9.3, 1, along with twin-scroll turbocharger and fuel and oil systems upgrades. This new engine will deliver more low-end torque than its predecessor and all-wheel drive will be available in this configuration. It is also expected to tow 3,500 pounds 1,600 kilograms in the redesigned Edge and 2017 Escape. Topic. Applications Approximately 245 horsepower 183 kilowatts 248 PS 275 pound feet 373 Nm 2015 Ford Edge 2015 Ford Everest 2015 Zenos E10S 2016 Ford Turnio 2016 Ford Escape Ford Kuga 2017 Ford Fusion 2016 Lincoln MKZ 2019 Lincoln MKC 250 horsepower 186 kilowatts 253 PS 280 pound feet 380 Nm 2019 Lincoln Nautilus 2020 Lincoln Corsair Topic 2.3L The 2.3L version of the EcoBoost engine debuted in the 2015 Lincoln MKC crossover and has been implemented in many Ford and Lincoln vehicles with various outputs. The 2.3L EcoBoost engine is produced with the 2.0L EcoBoost at the Valencia engine plant in Valencia, Spain. In March 2015 Ford announced the official production start of the all-new twin-scroll 2.0-liter and 2.3-liter EcoBoost engines for North America at its Cleveland engine plant in Ohio. Topic. Applications 270 horsepower, 201 kilowatts, 274 PS at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 310 pound-feet, 420 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute. 2019 Ford Ranger 280 horsepower, 209 kilowatts, 284 PS at 5,600 revolutions per minute, 310 pound-feet, 420 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute. 2016 to 2019 Ford Explorer, 2020 Lincoln Corsair. 285 horsepower, 213 kilowatts, 289 PS at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 305 pound-feet, 414 Nm at 2,750 revolutions per minute. 2015 to 2019 Lincoln MKC. 300 horsepower, 224 kilowatts, 304 PS at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 310 pound-feet, 420 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute. 2020 Ford Explorer 
310 horsepower, 231 kilowatts, 314 PS at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 320 to 350 pound-feet, 434 to 475 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute. 2015 Ford Mustang EcoBoost. 350 horsepower, 261 kilowatts, 355 PS at 6,000 revolutions per minute, 350 pound-feet, 475 Nm at 3,200 revolutions per minute. 2016 to 2018 Ford Focus RS. 2016 Zenos E10R. 385 horsepower, 287 kilowatts, 390 PS at 6,000 revolutions per minute, 369 pound-feet, 500 Nm at 3,200 revolutions per minute. 2016-2017, Vool, 05, RR. 276 horsepower, 206 kilowatts, 280 PS at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 310 pound-feet, 420 Nm at 3,000 to 4,000 revolutions per minute. 2019 Ford Focus Street, 2020. Topic V Type Six Cylinder. Topic 2.7 L Nano Introduced with the 2015 Ford F150 as a twin turbo 2.7 LV6 EcoBoost engine. It delivers 325 horsepower, 242 kilowatts, and 375 pound feet, 508 Nm. The engine is built at the Lima Ford engine plant. Ford has invested US$500 million United States dollars in the Lima plant for the new engine. Ford also states that the new engine will bring 300 jobs to Allen County, Ohio, but transfers from other plants make the actual number hard to pin down. A 335 HP version is to be an option on the 2017 Lincoln Continental. Being a next-generation design, it uses compacted graphite iron, a material Ford uses in its 6.7L power stroke diesel engine. Topic. Applications 325 horsepower, 242 kilowatts at 5,750 revolutions per minute, 375 pound-feet, 508 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute. 2015 to 2017 Ford F-150 335 horsepower, 250 kilowatts at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 380 pound-feet, 515 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute 2016 to 2018 Lincoln MKX 2017 Lincoln Continental 335 horsepower, 250 kilowatts at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 380 pound-feet, 515 Nm at 3,250 revolutions per minute. 2019 Lincoln Nautilus 315 horsepower, 235 kilowatts at 4,750 revolutions per minute, 350 pound-feet, 475 Nm at 2,750 revolutions per minute. 2015 to 2018 Ford Edge Sport. 335 horsepower, 250 kilowatts at 5,000 revolutions per minute, 380 pound-feet, 515 Nm at 3,000 revolutions per minute 2019 Ford Edge Street. 
325 horsepower, 242 kilowatts at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 380 pound-feet, 515 Nm at 3,500 revolutions per minute. 2017 Ford Fusion Sport. Topic. 2.7L Nano, second generation The second generation 2.7L EcoBoost V6 is being introduced with the 2018 Ford F150 and is mated to a 10-speed transmission that debuted the year prior. It produces an additional 25 pound-feet of torque over the first generation. The engine uses a compacted graphite iron CGI block, which is both high strength and lightweight. It boasts a number of changes from the first generation, with many carrying over from the second generation 3.5L EcoBoost engine that arrived a year earlier in the F-150. The most prominent change being the addition of port fuel injection, while keeping the direct injection system. It also has reduced internal friction to improve power and fuel economy, and new exhaust gas recirculation system. The specific output of the engine is now 121 horsepower per liter, versus the 395 HP Ford Coyote 5.0L naturally aspirated V8, which has a specific output of only 78 horsepower per liter. The peak torque matches the 5.0 LV8, albeit at a lower 2,750 revolutions per minute versus 4,500 revolutions per minute for the V8. Additional changes include a new lightweight cam to save weight, dual chain cam drive system that is stronger and reduces parasitic friction loss, a new electrically actuated wastegate that provides more accurate turbo boost control, a high pressure exhaust gas recirculation system, and a variable displacement oil pump that is electronically controlled to modulate oil flow to further reduce parasitic losses. Topic. Applications 325 horsepower, 242 kilowatts at 5,000 revolutions per minute, 400 pound-feet, 542 Nm at 2,750 revolutions per minute. 2018 Ford F-150 Topic. 3.0L A3 LV6 twin turbocharged gasoline direct injection engine, derived from the 2.7L EcoBoost, was released in 2016 that produces between 350 and 400 horsepower. Currently, the 3.0L is mostly exclusive to the Lincoln lineup to include the MKZ, which replaces the 3.7L TVCT Cyclone V6 engine the previous year, the Continental, and the upcoming 2020 Aviator and Ford Explorer. The engine offers dynamic torque vectoring with available AWD in selected models. The 3.0-liter version of the engine was created by increasing the 2.7-liter cylinder bore from 83.0 mm to 85.3, and by lengthening piston stroke by 3.0 mm to 86.0. It also drops the 2.7 liters compacted graphite iron main block in favor of cast aluminum. Topic: Applications. 350 horsepower, 261 kilowatts at 5,500 revolutions per minute, 400 pound-feet, 542 Nm at 2,750 revolutions per minute, front wheel drive only. 2017 Lincoln MKZ. 365 horsepower, 272 kilowatts at TBD, 380 pound-feet, 515 Nm at TBD. 
2020 Ford Explorer Platinum 400 horsepower 298 kilowatts at 5750 revolutions per minute 400 pound feet 542 nm at 2750 revolutions per minute all wheel drive only 2017 Lincoln Continental 2017 Lincoln MKZ 400 horsepower 298 kilowatts at TBD 415 pound feet 563 nm at TBD 2020 Ford Explorer Street 2020 Lincoln Aviator 470 horsepower 350 kilowatts at TBD 610 pound feet 827 nm at TBD 2020 Lincoln Aviator Hybrid Topic 3.5L The first Ford vehicle to feature this engine was the 2007 Lincoln MKR concept vehicle under the name Twinforce. The engine was designed to deliver power and torque output equivalent to a typical 6.0L or larger displacement V8 while achieving at least 15% better fuel efficiency and reduced greenhouse emissions. In the MKR, the concept Twinforce engine was rated at 415 horsepower, 309 kilowatts, and 400 pound-feet, 542 Nm of torque, as well as run on E85 fuel. When the same prototype engine reappeared in the Lincoln MKT concept in 2008 North American International Auto Show, the name was changed to EcoBoost. Official EcoBoost production began on May 19, 2009 at Cleveland Engine Plant No. 1. The production engines use the Duratec 35V6 engine block. The fuel charging and delivery systems can attain high fuel pressures up to 2,150 psi, necessary for efficient operation of the direct fuel injection system. The F-Series EcoBoost 3.5 LV6 uses two BorgWarner K03 turbochargers which can spin up to 170,000 revolutions per minute and provide up to 15 psi of boost. The transverse EcoBoost 3.5 LV6 uses two Garrett GT1549L turbochargers and provides up to 11 psi of boost. The turbos are set up in a twin turbo configuration. The engine can consume up to 25% more air over the naturally aspirated counterpart. Through the use of direct injection, the engine needs only regular grade gasoline to run. The EcoBoost V6 was first available as an engine option for 2010 Lincoln MKS, followed by 2010 Ford Flex, 2010 Ford Taurus Show, and 2010 Lincoln MKT. The fuel charging and delivery systems were co-developed with Robert Bosch GmbH. In 2009, Ford modified an experimental 3.5 LV6 EcoBoost engine with both E85 direct injection and gasoline indirect fuel injection, which achieved a brake mean effective pressure of 395 psi, 27 bars, which translates to roughly 553 pound-feet, 700 50 Nm of torque and 316 horsepower 236 kilowatts at 3000 revolutions per minute flat torque curve from 1500 to 3000 revolutions per minute topic applications 320 horsepower 239 kilowatts at 5500 revolutions per minute 400 pound feet 542 nm at 2250 revolutions per minute 2015 ford transit
355 horsepower, 265 kilowatts at 5,700 revolutions per minute, 350 pound-feet, 475 Nm at 3,500 revolutions per minute. 2010 to 2012 Ford Flex. 2010 to 2012 Lincoln MKS. 2010 to 2012 Lincoln MKT 365 horsepower 272 kilowatts at 5500 revolutions per minute 350 pound feet 475 Nm at 1500 to 5000 revolutions per minute 2010 to 2019 Ford Taurus show 2013 to 2019 Police Interceptor Sedan 2013 to 2016 Lincoln MKS 2013 to 2019 Lincoln MKT 365 horsepower 272 kilowatts at 5500 revolutions per minute 350 pound feet 475 Nm at 3500 revolutions per minute 2013 to 2019 Ford Explorer Sport 2016 to 2019 Ford Explorer Platinum 2013 to 2019 Ford Flex 2014 to 2019 Ford Police Interceptor Utility 365 horsepower 272 kilowatts at 5000 revolutions per minute 420 pound feet 569 Nm at 2500 revolutions per minute 2011 to 2016 Ford F150 365 horsepower 272 kilowatts at 5000 revolutions per minute 420 pound feet 569 Nm at 2250 revolutions per minute 2015 to 2017 Ford Expedition Expedition L 380 horsepower 283 kilowatts at 5250 revolutions per minute 460 pound feet 624 Nm at 2750 revolutions per minute 2015 to 2017 Lincoln Navigator Navigator L topic 3.5 LD35 second generation The second generation 3.5 L EcoBoost V6 codenamed D35 was introduced for the 2017 Ford GT revealed at the 2015 Detroit Auto Show in January as well as the 2017 F150 2018 Expedition and 2018 Navigator it produces up to 647 horsepower, 482 kilowatts, paired with a 7-speed semi-automatic transmission. This engine theoretically replaces the 5.4L supercharged modular V8 from the last generation Ford GT. The GT was on an 11-year hiatus and returned in 2016 for the 2017 model year. Also announced at the 2015 Detroit Auto Show was the 2017 Ford F-150 SVT Raptor, which is powered by an all-new 3.5L twin turbocharged EcoBoost V6. This new engine will produce 450 horsepower in the Raptor, up from the previous 6.2-L V8 a 411. The same second generation 3.5 LV6 is replacing the first generation engine in the 2017 F150 lineup. It will be standard on the F150 Limited and remain an optional upgrade for other trim levels. Paired with the second generation 3.5 L EcoBoost V6 is the new 10R80 10 speed automatic transmission that was co designed with GM. This new transmission will be outfitted on all second-generation 3.5 LV-6 EcoBoost F-150s. 
The 10 speed will be exclusive to the 3.5L EcoBoost engine in F 150s for the 2017 model year. Topic. Changes from previous generation The most prominent change is the addition of port fuel injection, while keeping the direct injectors. The port fuel injection was partly added due to the fuel output needs on the 3.5L HO Raptor engine, but also has several benefits for the 3.5L EcoBoost. It will prevent buildup on the intake valves and keep them clean due to fuel passing over the valves. Under certain engine conditions such as low RPM and low loads the high pressure fuel pump and direct injection system will turn off and the engine will only use the port fuel injection, reducing efficiency losses due to the HPFP. Both systems will operate at cold start, which will reduce emissions that direct injection suffers to due to cold cylinder walls and lower fuel atomization. Turbocharger changes include electronically actuated wastegates, turbine wheels now made with lighter MAR M247 super alloy increasing responsiveness, and the same 51mm turbine wheels but with sharper vane angles allowing boost to be increased by 2.5 psi .17 bars up to 16 psi 1 .1 bars max. The turbochargers continue to be supplied by Borg Warner. The cam drive system changed from a single primary chain to a stronger two primary chain system with separate chains driving each cylinder bank. In addition to dual primary chains, the side plates on the chains were also thickened. The cam chain drive sprocket on the crankshaft as a double gear arrangement to drive the two primary chains. These two changes were done to improve the harmonics, and are also stronger to help minimize the chain stretch that occurs over time on the first generation 3.5L EcoBoost. The camshafts were made hollow for weight savings, along with the addition of a roller finger follower valve train. The compression ratio was increased from 10.0, 1 to 10.5, 1, except on the 3.5L EcoBoost HO for the Raptor, which remains at 10.0, 1. The camshaft VCT phaser design was also changed to improve reliability and reduce the development of a tapping noise over time. Ford kept a single piston oil squirter per cylinder, but the oil volume was increased. The underside of the pistons were also redesigned to better transfer heat into oil from the new oil squirters. The engine also features auto start, stop, which decreases emissions during city driving by shutting the engine off in extended idling periods. The engines are also 4 pounds kilograms lighter than the previous 3.5L EcoBoost. Topic. Applications 375 horsepower 280 kilowatts at 5000 revolutions per minute 470 pound feet 637 nm at 2250 to 3500 revolutions per minute 2017 Ford F150 2018 Ford Expedition 400 horsepower 298 kilowatts at 5000 revolutions per minute 480 pound feet 651 nm at 3250 revolutions per minute 2018 Ford Expedition Platinum Series 450 horsepower 336 kilowatts at 5000 revolutions per minute 510 pound feet 691 nm at 3500 revolutions per minute 2017 Ford F150 Raptor 2019 Ford F150 Limited 2018 Lincoln Navigator 
647 horsepower, 482 kilowatts at 6250 revolutions per minute, 550 pound feet, 746 Nm at 5900 revolutions per minute. 2017 Ford GT. Topic See also Ford Duratec engine List of Ford engines Ford power shift transmission